Hello there, my name is Jeb Zinchapondo. I heard that you'll be attending a tournament very, very soon, and I would like to help you um, with a nutritional guide that you're going to share with your team and your parents so that we can be able to fuel our athletes or fuel you, uh, our football team, so that we can be able to participate very well in this upcoming tournament. More will be coming in later. Thank you very much. As I said before, I'll be sharing with you a nutritional guide that you can be using with the team and also share with your parents. Um, why does nutrition matter? Performance on the field is as much about proper training as it is also about proper nutrition. The right nutrition helps to increase stamina and endurance, to promote quicker recovery, to enhance strength um, and speed. And our goal is to fuel the body for optimal performance during the tournament. Um, with the key uh, nutritional goals that we may have, we need to make sure that our athletes have uh, enough energy and energy support physical demands with proper energy from carbohydrates. We, we also should be concentrating on the recovery of muscles and promoting muscle recovery with lean proteins and balanced meals. We also have to maintain hydration. It's very, very important um, uh, to be properly hydrated to maintain um, and uh, to, to maintain the, the moisture content or the water content in our bodies to avoid fatigue. And for mental focus, um, we need to be using uh, balanced meals to support concentration um, and decision making on the field. Right, towards the end of this presentation, I'll be sharing you some slides or some pictures um, that is going to show you some uh, breakdown in terms of um, the nutrition um, requirements that you may have to be using for you to be preparing for this tournament. Okay, um, so now we're going to speak about nutrient, uh, micronutrient uh, breakdown. All right, the, the nutrients that are necessary for the body, of course, are... We need carbohydrates, we need proteins, we need fats, we need fiber, we need water, we need vitamins, we need minerals. Um, all those are essential for our bodies. Now, the, the, the percentage content of, of these nutrients would be about 50 to 60 percent of um, carbohydrates. And uh, these ones are good and uh, necessary for, for primary uh, fuel for high density, high intensity performance. Um, and the proteins for muscle repair and recovery, you need about 15 to 20 percent of your meal, and fat 20 to 30 percent for um, long lasting energy and joint health. Okay, um, when it comes to uh, pre game uh, meals, uh, you need to be eating about three to four hours before the game, and uh, you focus on high, ca high carbohydrates for energy. Um, moderate protein and low fats. These are the meals that are supposed to be taken before the games. For example, war, war grain pasta um, with lean chicken and veggies, um, brown rice with the good uh, fish, uh, fruit smoothies with oats. Um, such meals can be able to assist um, in that. And um, athletes should be taking a lot of um, vegetables as well and fruits uh, as you can see uh, because they help a lot with with vitamins uh, bananas have got riboflavin which is good for for aiding in in developing of of the blood and uh, blood carries uh, oxygen uh, and which is necessary for for athlete uh, performance and do not forget to hydrate you need to take a lot of water water is very necessary uh, bananas, energy bars, or electrolyte drinks helps also in terms of the boost in energy. So these come in handy uh, as fruits to be used in in such um, situations. Then we have post game um, uh, nutrition. Uh, post game recovery meals. Um, the timing is eat within thirty to sixty minutes after your game, and you're focusing on replenishing uh, glycogen with carbs and repair uh, muscles with protein. Um, um, 
Examples would be uh, grilled chicken with uh, roasted veggies, smoothie with uh, protein, berries, and spinach, whole wheat grain, um, whole grain bread with nut uh, butter in a fruit shake. Okay, then there are some hydration strategies that you have to employ in terms of balancing um, the nutrition for you um, within the pre-game uh, uh, pre situation and also after the game. You need to drink 500 milliliters of water two hours before the game so that you'll be fully hydrated. During the game, sip water on sports drinks or sports drinks every 15 to 20 minutes. Just taking a, a bit of a sip will make, make sure you keep on being um, um, hydrated. Rehydrate um, with water and electrolytes after the game as well. Uh, and you, you need to monitor urine color as hydration indicator. Um, that uh, is a good indication of how hydrated you are. The meal plan um, example that we're going to give to use is, for example, when it comes to breakfast, you may take oatmeal with fruit and nuts, uh, scrambled eggs, because there's a lot of, of protein in, in eggs, uh, grilled chicken uh, for lunch and sandwich, um, sweet potatoes, Greek salad, all of these assist in terms of, of the lunch. Um, then a pre-game snack. You can have a snack before a game. You can have Greek yogurt with honey and, and banana. Um, Post-game meal, you can have fish, salmon with brown rice and steamed vegetable. And then evening snack would be cottage cheese with mixed berries. Um, and uh, pretty much this would be able to help you as, as a good diet for, um, for preparing for your tournament. Um, then there are also supplements that can be taken. You need a lot of multivitamins to ensure that there is a daily micro um, nutrient intake. Um, protein to support muscle repair in post game, creatine for improved strength and endurance. Electrolytes to restore minerals lost during intense activity. Um, and, mm. All right, let's now talk about the do's and don'ts uh, when it comes to um, playing in the tournament. Um, you need to prioritize wall food. Uh, eat regularly to maintain energy and always hydrate consi consistently. Avoid processed or the sugary food. Do not skip meals or eat large meals close to the game. Um, do not forget to hydrate. The takeaway message um, in, in the, all of this is that nutrition is the foundation of performance. Um, focus on balanced meals, hydration and recovery strategies. Let's fuel our bodies to be at our best for the tournament. These are the pictures that I suggested that you take a look towards the end of this presentation. All right, thank you. That wraps up um, my presentation in terms of the nutritional guide that you need uh, for you to be participating in your upcoming tournament. Thank you very much.